Welcome to this video! Mickey is our opponent and um, yeah I wanted to try a gambit but uh, the fire ritz doesn't work here anymore so maybe we can play some kind of uh, Volga or Benko gambit um, let's see okay so my plan was c4 b5 later on but uh, this also doesn't work here so we have some weird looking um, Benoni without c4 uh, I know with c4 um, you should play knight fd7 because otherwise sometimes it's possible for, for white to push for e5 but I don't see here a reason so let's get out here and okay now he wants to play f4 hmm what what I want to do is now uh, try to use this diagonal and um, open up the e file as well. He wants to play knight c4, so it's very difficult for me to play e6 afterwards. So I think I should rather play it now. If he takes, I uh, always have the option to push for a d5 later on and I have a strong pawn center and, and the open f file. So I'm not scared about him taking on, on, on e6. Um, yeah, here I think I just attack the bishop directly. This move rather helped me, um, I think. And hmm, I don't mind taking here. Yeah, now I can even open this diagonal here for the bishop. And hmm, queen h4 maybe even. If he castles knight g4, it could be irritating for him. Uh, I think I do this. Maybe also bishop g4. Yeah, I'm much better developed. Um, I just have problems to get this rook into the game. Maybe I should even sacrifice this pawn. If he takes rook b8 and I have pressure again here. Yeah, <clears throat> in this position I thought knight g4 might be good. If he plays h3, um, I can play maybe bishop e5. Or, you know, sacrifice uh, somewhere later on. If he pl pushes in his... Uh, I mean, after playing <coughs> bishop e5, f4, I can play knight e3, attacking here these pieces. I think I like this. Just trying, you know, to to force him to weaken the kingside position. Um, I wanted to force him to weaken the kingside position. Okay, this doesn't didn't work, unfortunately. Um, he just retreated the knight here to f3. I thought he might jump to c4 with the knight, but I think it's a good move to help to defend a bit the the kingside. Um, what about playing bishop e5 here? Hmm. And what I also can do is trying to open up the f file. I think I'll do this. Yeah, he wants to uh, to op um, develop his bishop. Um. Okay. Here he just blundered very strange okay from the Philippines yeah I mean in, in the end um, the whole uh, setup let us see I think there was nothing wrong with all these games in, in, uh, in the opening um, however if you play something like this I think you should um, exchange the bishop here against uh, the knight. I mean, um, 
this bishop is somewhat locked in into uh, the pawn chain here and um, this might be just an idea to take here, here the knight although it also gives me some air so it, it's not really a, a, um, a bad move to play bishop c4 because um, I mean he has some pressure here on the white squares as well but I think he loses a lot of time and you can see that he moved the, the bishop now one, two, three, four times already and um, yeah I'm, I'm almost fully developed so um, I think white lost too much time by moving his pieces uh, way too often and uh, this is a real uh, problem maybe with the setup here um, despite this blunder here I mean the, the position of, of, of black I think is um, already very very comfortable I might just you know try to weaken somewhere here the kingside position with bishop e5 or I just open up the position with f5 taking here and then I uh, threaten to sacrifice if you play something like h3 I could always think about you know just uh, playing knight, uh, knight to e5 um, and exchanging some more um, pieces here of, uh, of the uh, shielder of the white king or just knight f6 you know attacking here the bishop and then playing uh, bishop g4 or uh, I mean after h3 even sacrificing here and taking uh, with the queen it's um, it's quite dangerous I think the whole setup here and um, these pieces are not you know that much in, in the game uh, it's not threatening anything here this bishop and I can bring this bishop over to g4 or h3 maybe later on as well thanks for watching